on the other website. So uh, what happened? I don't know. Let me see what happened here. I got out of it. Let me get back in it. <clears throat> I probably clicked on the wrong thing. Uh, but when you click on, oh, I know what happened. Uh, it's got this arrow thing there. Now I can click on it. So if you click on the herb that I'm going to describe, then it takes you over to where you can actually see the product. You can see the sizes. You can see the, the, the uh, different types, whether it's available in a liquid or a capsule or a powder or a tea, all the different ways that it's available. So if you click on any product in the report, you can click on it and go see the product and you can order it online uh, from the store. And again, I get nothing from the sale and neither does Doc, uh, Doc Miles. We don't get anything from the sale of any products here on this website. I don't uh, get anything that Jim Nimmer Silvestri, if you click on it, I don't get anything from it and neither does the Doc. Now, the, this, the, this plant, Jim Nimmer Silvestri, the reason why we use it is in its Hindi name in India. Uh, it translates. The translation of Gymnema Silvestri translates as sugar destroyer. So it destroys the sugar. And the plant is said to reduce the ability to detect sweetness. You're not going to be able to taste the sweetness. And that's regarded as one of the most powerful herbs for blood sugar control. And it may work by boosting the activity of the enzymes that help cells use glucose or by stimulating the production of insulin. They're not sure how it works uh, because there's no money in doing the research for it. So they don't do the research. That's why you never hear about it. That's why the doctors don't have a cure because they don't know about it. They don't do the research because there's no money in it because it's all about money for them. And herbalists have been here since the beginning of time, and, <clears throat> and we help people. And Gymnema sylvestri is one herb, but bitter melon is another, also known as mom or dica. It's also, it, it helps this bitter melon, mom or dica, uh, it helps the cells to use glucose more effectively, and it blocks sugar absorption in the intestine. So when you start combining these correctly, all of the sudden, <clears throat> the problems that you're having with sugar are gone. Then you're taking calcium and magnesium because it is a known common deficiency uh, with people with diabetes. So we make sure that you, you get uh, good, high-tech, high-quality calcium and magnesium. So that's listed there. And then there's prickly pear cactus because it's a fruit that helps lower blood sugar because it contains components that work similarly to insulin. The fruit is also high in fiber, prickly pear cactus. And then there's the simple inexpensive mineral chromium. And people with diabetes, they're, they're not getting enough chromium. And when you get when, when you start putting these and lining these up and doing these things, that's why people are reporting back they don't have diabetes anymore. And it doesn't come back. You don't have to do this for life. What you, we do is we put the uh, restore order in the, the, uh, the glandular system and things go back to work again. And because the Lord... Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, uh, Ahaya Ashar Ahaya, in, in the name of Yeshaya. He 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 has uh, uh, created a body that will heal itself if you give it the nutrients, and these are the nutrients. Then there's Intramax, over 415 all organic ingredients. That's a multiple vitamin mineral supplement par excellence. I mean, it is the it is the best. So you're now you're getting a great all organic over 415 ingredients, multiple vitamin. So we're really nourishing the body and giving it some energy 
to get over diabetes. Then there's a glucose balance capsules. Now, here's where it gets better. is because the glucose balance capsules are a combination of the herbs we just talked about. Uh, it's got the uh, Gymnema sylvestri. It's got the Mormordica, but it doesn't have the uh, prickly pear cactus. That's something you could add later if you were, uh, if it was a stubborn case. Then we can bring on the prick, prickly pear cactus. But in the meantime, uh, there is a formula that already has and combined the Mormordica, the Gymnema sylvestri, and they've added bilberry leaf and alpha lipoic acid. Uh, and, and vanadyl sulfate, and bean pods, and uh, bilberry fruit, and blueberry leaf, and hyssop leaf, and pleurisy root, and paprika, and uva ursi, and that's called glucose balance capsules, and it's also available in a liquid. And when you start doing those kinds of things, <clears throat> people are telling us, no more, no more diabetes. Uh, there's a video here uh, of testimonies. There is a uh, testimony here about it as well. well. We'll get into that in a minute. But why are we using bilberry leaf and fruit? Because it's the relative of blueberry. Bilberry is a little stronger than the blueberry. It contains powerful antioxidants in its fruit and in its leaves. Uh, these antioxidants called anthocyanidins seem to help prevent damage <clears throat> to tiny blood vessels that can result in nerve pain and retinopathy, uh, you know, and damage to the eye's retina. Uh, and, uh, and would also be a good thing to know about if there is varicose veins. Uh, bilberry fruit and leaf would, would, would be another good one to, to help that problem as well. Animal studies have also suggested that bilberry may lower blood sugar. So here we go. We're just lowering that blood sugar all over the place. So what's the alpha lipoic acid doing? Because it's called ALA. <clears throat> and that's for short. Because this vitamin-like substance neutralizes many types of free radicals. Uh, it's, it's a, you know, a buildup of free radicals uh, caused in part by high blood sugar can lead to nerve damage. And so here's where we work in with this neuropathy, is this alpha lipoic acid. When you, and, and, and we're really getting some help here with alpha lipoic acid because it, it helps to, you know, to, to stop this nerve damage and other problems. ALA may also help muscle cells take up the blood sugar. Uh, another one that we could add if we needed it is uh, fenugreek seeds. Fenugreek seeds uh, used in Indian cooking have been found to lower blood sugar and increase insulin sensitivity and reduce high cholesterol, according to several animal and human studies, uh, and, and also high in fiber fenugreek seeds. The seeds also contain an amino acid that appears to boost the release of insulin. So now we're helping it all work with fenugreek seeds. And, th th and so that's one that could be added uh, if, you know, if we want to get serious. And, and that's the thing. You don't just do one, two, three, or four. You do five, six, eight, or ten of these things. And all of a sudden, you're, you are overpowering an overpowering situation, uh, you just bring in enough support. And then after you've controlled it and you, and, you, and you no longer have symptoms of diabetes, you back away. You back away and stop taking this, that, and the other thing. And, and the body goes to work all by itself. But there's more. There's all these things that can help. And here's more. Ginseng is known for its immune boosting. It's immune boosting and uh, disease-fighting benefits, ginseng. It also pulls the radiation out of the body. Now, of this Chinese herb, an American herb also, ginseng, <clears throat> has several positive diabetes studies behind it. Uh, researchers have found that ginseng, Panax ginseng, uh, 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 slows 
carbohydrate absorption and increases cells ability to use glucose and increases insulin uh, secretion from the pancreas so and then there's a, a diabetes T okay now uh, diabetes T a formula uh, with a combination of herbs that helps regulate and balance the glucose blood sugar uh, level it, it, it's got a lot of these herbs that we just talked about uh, in it uh, let's take a look and see what is in that formulation. Let's see if we can do that. No, let's see. I've got to go down a little more. Now I can click on it. Let's take a look and see what's in a diabetes tea formula because there's a diabetes tea and there's a diabetes liquid. And the di this is the diabetes tea extract. This is a concentrated herbal formula with bean pods, white kidney beans, mormordica, uh, bitter melon, uh, uva ursi leaf, bilberry fruit, huckleberry, blueberry leaf, gymnema sylvestri leaf, structured water, uh, that can get, you know, the, uh, uh, the alkaline water, split molecule water, uh, that's the way it's made, and 20% alcohol to preserve it, and if you don't like alcohol, they make one in a glycerin base, if you don't, so you got, you have your choice. Uh, of uh, of the tea, uh, the liquid, and let's go back to the diabetes report. But anyway, that's that is a diabetes insulin support extract. And then there's the diabetes. Uh, so you, there's a diabetes insulin support. That's the tincture extract. Then there's a diabetes herbal tea. So you can get it as a tea. You can get it as an extract. And then if there was the worst case scenario which we very seldom have to use this anymore. It's a diabetes support herbal formula of other herbs. So there's a lot of help. And then finally, there is a gland rejuvenator. Now that gland rejuvenator was really something because I took eight separate formulations so that I could work on all of the glands at the same time. And I combined it together and it just worked perfectly when I got it balanced out and it's oh well, that's about 40 years ago we made the gland rejuvenator where, we, where we're working on all the glands at the same time then if you so there we are we have a gland rejuvenator here with all these herbs in it and uh, and then there's a diabetes kit there's a and, and then there's a diabetes plus kit so that you can combine certain of these and get started on uh, a few of these things, uh, de depending on what your budget is, uh, then you'd get a diabetes kit or a diabetes plus kit and, and get all these different things. And then below that, uh, uh, in 2016, uh, Elder Rakaw uh, gave his testimony uh, in an interview with me uh, on his broadcast, uh, uh, the Gathering of Christ Church. Uh, GOCC, nice folks, and <clears throat> and he was saying how that his wife had serious kidney problems, and they're cleared up now because she went on the marshmallow root tea and the kidney bladder formula and a few of those other herbs that were for the kidneys that are that are in the kidney bladder report. Now he she used them and no longer had any kidney disorders. And he said, hey, by the way, he said, I'm having a lot of people come to me that are going, that are going on that diabetes system that you, you've been using, and they don't have diabetes anymore. And then he went on to, to encourage everybody to support their herbalists uh, be, because uh, we're losing our herbalists. We're losing them. We're, we're losing our naturopathic doctors. We're losing our chiropractic uh, practitioners and holistic practitioners. Uh, 60 of these uh, holistic practitioners have died mysteriously. They, well, they don't exist anymore. They disappear off the face of the earth. 60 of them in 18 months. So while there are still some practitioners left on the planet here in America, you should go to them. You should find their wisdom that they've gained 
uh, for decades and decades and since the beginning of time. The new guy on the block is the drug pushing medical doctors with their chemical drugs. And there's a time and a place, but it isn't to keep diabetes and diabetics from getting help. And that's what they're doing because they keep saying there's no cure for it. But what Elder Raka is saying is that there is, that people are coming to him saying that, and there's a video uh, of that. Then below that video, and there's a, <clears throat> and that video also talks about diabetes, a uh, diabetes video. Uh, <clears throat> and, uh, and then it gives a, a testimony. And, and let me share that with you because uh, this young fellow by the name of Josh, he said, he starts at his high Dr. Truman. He said, my name is Josh. And six months ago, my girlfriend told me that you can help me reverse diabetes. I was skeptical, you know, at first, being that I've been a, di a, 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 a had diabetes for over 10 years. My girlfriend uh, pushed and insisted uh, that I contact you, uh, telling me that it won't hurt to give you a call. So I called and I talked to you and you explained and, and, and I explained my situation to you and you listened to my situation and you suggested uh, that I take glucose balance capsules and chromium and diabetes herbal tea and diabetes tea extract and you told me to, to continue uh, taking my medication and <clears throat> that you that I that uh, that I would gradually uh, start to see your sugar levels go down and uh, you should be off of medication in about maximum four months to make a long story short I beat it with your help I am no longer a diabetic. I went to see my medical doctor on 4-18-16, just about a year ago. <clears throat> when he asked me why I'm here, I informed him that the endocrinology doctor wants me to take this blood test before I see him on 421. My medical doctor informed me that I was no longer a diabetic for for a few months so he, he 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 was on it for four months but in two months he was actually over it he didn't have diabetes uh, after after a few months too and 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 he and the medical doctor said that I no longer have to see my endocrinology doctor and everybody uh, family, co-workers, doctors, uh, assistants, neighbors, and people that just know me in the area uh, that I travel around uh, are, are so happy for me, except one person, uh, my endocrinology doctor. When I called him to cancel and let him know I would not be coming back, uh, being that I'm no longer a diabetic, I never received a call from him so fast, really fast, within five minutes. My cancellation call uh, to tell to tell me that I was uh, I'm misinformed, that uh, that there's no such thing as reversing diabetes, and that I need to continue taking my medications and come to see him. Uh, like I said, uh, like I said in the beginning, <clears throat> in my letter to you. My medical doctor said I no longer have diabetes and I don't need to take the insulin or pills anymore and keep up, keep up the good work. Uh, so it's been about five months that I've been diabetes free now. So I'd like to thank you very much for your help. Also, like I said, uh, uh, thank you to my girlfriend. Dorian Taylor for pointing me to the in the right direction. I'm now working on my high blood pressure. I uh, 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 I was talking to your granddaughter uh, 
uh, over there at Health and Herbs because they help a lot of people. This is a telephone number that you want, by the way. I'll give it to you in a minute. Now, he was talking to my grand, my granddaughter, <clears throat> who, who manufactures all these natural remedies, because I taught her how to do it. And she does it with, with, with uh, some other, you know, with some of the other family, uh, grandchildren and great grandchildren. Um, and because I have one daughter who blessed me with eight grandchildren. One daughter blessed me with eight grandchildren. The eight grandchildren blessed me with 13 great grandchildren so far. But anyway, she, he, he, she was talking to my granddaughter and she suggested that I take the blood pressure plus drops. So once again, thank for your help. Now, so that's it. That's it. That's a wonderful testimony. And his name is Josh uh, uh, Kersey, K-E-A-R-S-E. -E. <clears throat> but that, and we get, that isn't the only testimony we have. We have others. So, and, and, and with that blood pressure, if you're really having this and struggling with the blood pressure, work on the kidneys. Go to the kidney bladder report. Just like I've gone to the diabetes report. That's how to take care of diabetes. Go to the kidney bladder report and take that herbal marshmallow root tea and the kidney bladder drops. And uh, let's get that blood pressure under control. Because when blood pressure is out of control and, and you just can't control it, work on the kidneys and the blood pressure at the same time. Doc... I I I I got to, I I just had to uh, I I just had to finish that diabetes report thing. What do you think? Well, that you covered all the bases. You did a great job on that because <laughs> it uh, it's a it's a real plague in this country. So many people have diabetes. One thing about a diabetic that can't eat potatoes, they can't eat pasta, and they have to limit their carbohydrates to no more. Than 30 milligrams a day. That's two pieces of bread. Okay? Yeah. No bread, no potatoes, anything that's a carbohydrate turns to sugar. <clears throat> so you have to limit yourself big time. Lots of fresh veggies, no beans. Beans are high in carbs too. Um, green beans are okay, but I'm talking about red beans and all that stuff. Um, uh, you know, a nice little piece of meat, about the palm, size of the palm of your hand. White meat, chicken, white meat, turkey, white fish, you know, and cover it with onions and, you know, steam it for a little bit. It's delicious. Sure. And it's a great way to eat. And people start losing weight if they hold their carbohydrates to no more than 30 milligrams a day. <clears throat> you got to look at the packages, you know, because a lot of them say, you know, 40 milligrams in one serving. What? I mean, in one serving, not much. And then all of a sudden, you don't want to eat that to get something that doesn't have so many carbs in it. But just watching carbs, what I've been doing, you know, this month of April, I mean, I lost 17 pounds. Just watching my carbs. <laughs> it's wow. so simple. Yes. Yes. Because we are, we are what we eat. And we're also a product of our environment. I mean, look at the coal miners years and years ago before they had all this uh, sophisticated equipment. They'd go down the coal mines with a little mask on their on their nose, and by the time they were 40 years old, they died with black lung because that was their environment. That's what they worked in. Now they've increased, you know, the safety uh, features and all that, you know, for the miners. But anything that you do, you know, like... A welder out there, if he's welding on, on galvanized metal, it's a lot of sulfur in there and it'll make you sick. Then you have to drink a glass of milk to keep from getting sick because you feel like you got the flu. You feel horrible. And some people can't drink milk, so they just suffer. So there's so many things you have to look at in today's world of our choices of foods. You have to watch what you eat to make sure that you put the right stuff in your body to compensate for the issues that you might have. So it's just so important to watch your carbs. Yes, absolutely. Too much sugar. So we've got to watch that sugar. You know, I, I, I'm very fortunate because the diet in that Make Lifestyle Changes diet that I use <clears throat> um, 
it, uh, it keeps me at my perfect weight, 140 pounds, five foot seven. That's it. I, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm locked in there. And I'm not getting enough exercise, though, Doc. I got to get out. I'm waiting for summer to come here in Oregon, and it's uh, it, it doesn't come till about in the middle of June. That's when summer shows up. But the weather's getting better, and I'll start going outside. I just don't feel like working out when the when the weather's not warm. I don't know what it is. I, I like warm well, weather, and then I want to work out. One of the best exercises, believe it or not. And it can be summertime, it can be wintertime, it can be raining, it can be storming. You get one of those little mini trampolines and put it in the corner of your bedroom. So if you start to, to fall, you can grab the wall. But just a little light mouse, you know, just a few inches. You know, put on some athletic socks so you don't blister your feet. Five minutes in the morning, five minutes in the evening. Because what that does, your lymphatics, you got two and a half times more lymphatic fluid than you have blood. And you have 13 pints of blood. So you move, or uh, you move the lymphatics because it goes through a series of check valves. So then you bounce up and then the lymphatics are up and then the valve closes behind it and you bounce down, you bounce up again and you keep on doing that, bouncing five minutes in the morning, five minutes at night, you get rid of all the debris and lymphatics. It's amazing, amazing, amazing. Then after a week, you can go up to six or seven minutes twice a day and you get to where you're doing maybe 10 minutes twice a day. Put on some nice soft music and, or rock and roll music, whatever you like, and just bounce to the music. It's a great, great thing, and it doesn't hurt your joints. People get out there and put on tennis shoes and run down the highway. Man, that's, number one, it's dangerous. Number two, it just ruins your skeleton. Oh, yeah. That's really hard on the bones. <laughs> it's hard on the hard on the bones, hard on the bones. And so if people get a little trampoline, it's amazing what it does. It's amazing. I've, I've told many, many, many patients about that over the years. And when it's cold, wet, rainy, you don't want to be outside walking or jumping or whatever or running, just bounce in the bedroom and, and do it in your pajamas. Who cares, you know? <laughs> and it, it's really the best uh, all around that you can do. Because most people don't have a heated swimming pool to go swim in, and that's a good exercise too. But and you don't know what's in that swimming pool if it belongs to somebody else. You know what I'm saying? But the uh, mini trampoline is so easy. You can get it at Kmart or, or Target or Walmart. They all sell these little mini trampolines. They're not expensive. Now you can get online. You can buy them for four hundred dollars if you get those expensive things. But nobody needs that. No. You know. <clears throat> It folds up. It's got a carrying case. You can carry it wherever you got. That's crazy. But just a mini trampoline for about 40, 50 bucks. And boy, you got, you got a great exercise equipment. Better than spending the money on these, you know, thousand dollars worth of equipment that, that you buy, you see on TV every day. And, uh, you know, it's good. It does help. But the best is moving those lymphatics. You got to move it out. Anytime you cut yourself, and the blood stops coming, it coagulates, you'll see that clear substance around that wound. That's the lymphatic fluids coming out to take away any bacteria or anything from the cut. Takes it in, runs it through the system, and runs it out through the lymphatic fluids. That's why you need to move the lymphatics to get rid of that junk that it pulled in from the body. So people don't understand the the importance of the lymphatic fluids. And they don't understand the uh, importance of drinking plenty of good water every day. I mean, you can drown yourself if you drink too much, but half of your body weight in ounces is perfect. Because 75% of your body is water, 90% of your brain is water. If you're having a cloudy day, you can't think clearly, Things are just not coming to your mind like you wanted to. Drink a glass of water in just a few minutes, the lights come on. It's amazing. People need to try that and see if that doesn't work, because it does. It works like a champ. Most people don't drink enough water, and we see a lot of dehydration. You know, if we see the mesophils or estophils and the blood work is real high, that's the first sign of dehydration, period. Yes. 
Yes, that's a, that's some good information. I you know I really like that idea about that mini trampoline. I used to have one years ago, but you know it got away. I don't. But I think it's maybe time for me to get another mini trampoline. You know, <clears throat> it's kind of fun. I mean, it reminds me of when I was a kid and I jumped up and down on the bed. That's right. That's right. <laughs> and why why do kids think about this? True. Why do kids jump up and down on the bed? Nature tells them they need to jump. Yep. <laughs> they instinctively jump up and down because it's moving their lymphatics. They don't know the reason why. They just feel the urge to do it. Nature yeah. encourages them to do it, and it helps them stay well. Yeah. I mean, i got a grandson. As soon as he gets here, sometimes on the weekend, he gets out of mm -hmm. my son's truck. He goes straight to the trampoline. He's got a big one out here in my yard. Man, he bounces on that thing for two or three hours. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I don't know how he does it, but, you know, he's a kid, you know, and they oh, can yeah. do stuff like that. Yeah. You know, we can't do that. Well, I mean, five minutes is enough for me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, I, I when I was a kid, I, I, I used to love those trampolines, and, <clears throat> and I, I got pretty good at it, but that was a long time ago. I could do those double circle flips and back flips and all that kind of stuff. It was really cool, but hey, you know, I was a, young, a youngster back in those days, and that was fun to do. I don't, <laughs> we did a lot of things when we was younger, and we didn't know why we was doing it. It was our our body telling us that we needed to jump to move the lymphatics. Yeah. And we didn't know the reason why. It was just fun. Yep. So, Absolutely. Great idea. Good. Great good. idea. Yes. Th those are, those are good ideas and good suggestions uh, to help to improve your health and get those lymph glands moving and and, and and so that you can improve your health and have more energy and so forth. And and you don't have to, you know, even a person with varicose veins, they, they can kind of jiggle a little bit up and down. They don't have to jump up and down like, you know, like you're like you're seven years old again. You just kind of move in a little bit. Let's, because it doesn't take much, does it, Doc? No, three or four inches is all you need, just a little bit. Because you're moving those lymphatics and the check valves are moving behind it to move the flow of lymphatic fluid to the system. Just a little bit. You know, you don't have to bounce and bounce and bounce and try to touch a ceiling. That's not, that's crazy. I mean, you and I would hurt ourselves with the end up in the middle of the floor and couldn't get up. <laughs> wow. So, it, it, so another thing came up here today that, we're, you know, and that's high blood pressure. That was mentioned, right. which goes along with diabetes and which goes along right. with kid, kidney bladder disorders. So, so the, uh, high blood pressure. So let's just touch on it just a little bit besides working on the kidney bladder uh, and taking a high blood pressure herbal formulation tincture extract, which would be a good idea. We'll talk about it. <clears throat> it high blood pressure. It's, it's, it's a popular issue among a lot of Americans across the country. The fast lifestyle of fast food, soda, stress, especially stress, is starting to catch up with the, the average American. And so much so that an estimated one in every three people has high blood pressure. That's a lot of high blood pressure. One out of, one out, one in every three. This puts if you look at their, if you look at their blood work, if you look at the people's blood work, there are so many people eating junk foods, fatty foods, and stuff they can't break down, and their triglycerides are off the chart. That's the first signs of blood pressure when the triglycerides are highly elevated, okay? And that's the first thing I look at. When they come in and say, I got high blood pressure, I'll look at their cholesterol levels, and triglycerides will be two or 300. When it gets over 400, it won't even read the bad cholesterol because it's too high. And they have extreme blood pressure because of, because of the uh, triglycerides. And the single most important thing for that person is uh, DHA, which is an omega-3. And, and that omega is just awesome. The one I use is uh, out of Wisconsin. They use the whole premium fish, not the skeleton. And they make the best DHA you've ever seen. And boy, you take two or three of those a day, and after just a few months, 
all of a sudden your your triglycerides are coming down, coming down, coming down, and all of a sudden your blood pressure eases up. But there's other things that contribute to blood pressure. Like that's a number one key that I look for because it, it happens like you say. One out of every three people I'll see that high triglycerides. That's why I do the blood work, all of the panels, so I can see all the organs and what is feeding those organs and what deficits those organs have in relationship to the blood that's running through their veins, running through that special program in my computer, and I can tell exactly what's causing their issues. It's so, so easy, and I don't, I don't diagnose it. I don't treat it. I only make suggestions on what I see. It's up to them to do it. If they say, well, I just don't want to do that, well, you know, I, at least I pointed it out to you. I educated you on what your issues are. You have to take care of them. And usually they do, and all of a sudden they, they're so much better because they're giving the body the right things, like you said a while ago, to heal. You have to feed the body to heal. And like the liver support that I get out of uh, uh, India. My God, that's the best liver support I've ever seen. Knocks allergies out really quickly because 95% of your skin conditions and allergies is because the liver has a problem. And the liver changes every cell in 120 days. So if you take the liver, the liver support for 120 days, you got a new liver. There it is. You can cut half. You can cut half of the liver out and throw it away. It grows back to its original size. The only organ in the body that does that. It's amazing what it does. Yeah. If you know how to work with that liver, that liver will will make a big comeback. Uh, but and, and that's the key here is is when you're working on things like high blood pressure and kidney disorders and diabetes. We the the liver is generally at the seat of a lot of problems. So if you're work if you got a really functional liver, the kidneys are happy and functioning again. And you're working on that the rest of the glandular system and the digestive tract, you, you find out you you know it, it's our job to do a lot of work to find out really what's going on. <clears throat> and that's where it's so important that the blood work panels that can be done in the town where someone lives. For instance, uh, a lady in the United Kingdom yesterday asked me to contact you because she wanted to go to her local laboratory and, and, and she wants to know which blood panels she should ask for so that she could <clears throat> yeah, get uh, uh, the get the correct information to you. Uh, and, and then they send that information, that report to you. Then you put it through your computer, and you got this 18-page report that you're um, looking over and, and 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 determining what's going on. And and nobody else does what you're doing there like that. Nobody else does that. So, uh, you know, you don't have, what, I, what I'm saying is, you don't have to live uh, in, in Georgetown, Texas, uh, in order for Doc Miles to help you. Uh, he can help you and do lots of diagnostic things and give you tons of great information. All you have to do is call him on the telephone and he'll help you. So let me give you that number. Doc Miles' telephone number is 512-868-9867. That's 512-868-9867. Call Doc Miles and he can get to the bottom of the most difficult situations. And in the meantime, you know, we have all these reports that you also can access on herbalhealthreview.com. Uh, you know, about high blood pressure, about diabetes, and then you can call me on the telephone because I want to help you. And you have, and, but you need to call me and, and we can discuss what's going on. And that telephone number to call Truman is 
Five zero three, three six two five eight nine nine. That's five zero three, three six two five eight nine nine. I can get that out. There. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, Trevor, I, I, you yes. did send me an email on that lady from UK, and I was so busy today I didn't have a chance to answer, but I'll answer it tomorrow. I'm, I'm thank thanks, Doc. Well, I'll, I'll let I'll let uh, her know. You see, people contact me from all over the world. And that lady right. con t contacted me from the United Kingdom on Skype. And if anybody wants to know how to contact me on Skype anywhere in the world, and it's free, uh, my Skype name is one long word, Master Herbalist, Master Herbalist. And that's my Skype name. And then we can talk. Uh, and, 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 and help people all over the world for free. We do that, you know, you, you just uh, on Skype. And it, I, I, I bought a Skype <clears throat> membership, wow, 10 years ago. And I had, and, I, and when, I, when I bought it, I bought $25 worth of minutes. I don't use long distance because I can't afford to call people long distance. They can call me. I can't call them. <clears throat> and so, so I, I still have, after 10 years, Doc, I still got $3.68 left. Good Lord. And, and I've, had, I've had free Skype for 10 years. I'm looking at people. They're looking at me. I'm pasting in reports, information, and everything, and it's free, essentially, as, as long as I'm not calling long distance, which I'm not. So that's where right. So anyway, Master Herbalist on Skype. My telephone number, 503-362-5899. Doc Miles' telephone number, 512-868-9867. Oh, the telephone number for BetterHealthHerbs.com that manufactures all the products that I don't get anything from because I only work on donation alone, folks. So the telephone number for any of the products, if you want to talk to the manufacturer, they will help you. That's they they, they will make suggestions and they will they help people every day. Call Health and Herbs in Albany, Oregon. 541-794-7000. That's 541 seven nine one eighty four hundred and they're there for about another half hour or less twenty eight exactly one half hour they'll be there for another half hour at health and herbs that manufactures all the products that I'm talking about here today that are in these reports uh, and then uh, products that doc miles is talking about uh, there's he has a, a lot of very unique things that he uh, uh products that he uses including magnets some very interesting magnets that get rid of that aches and pains and frozen shoulders and all that kind of stuff doc miles has got some really cool stuff so uh but uh, that telephone number again for for health and herbs in albany oregon 541-791-8400 well i always have to make sure you have all the ways to contact these people because uh, <clears throat> there's one thing to talk about something. It's another, there's a whole nother deal to talk about something that you can actually get. Okay. <clears throat> so, so anyway, uh, doc, did you have any other, uh, uh, any other topic or information or anything you wanted to share with us as we're getting closer to the top of the hour? Well, I'm kind of burned out for the day. So my brain is not working. Right, right now. But uh, <laughs> but anyway, um, no, I'll just about you know come to the end of my day, I guess. I, I understand but, uh, that. Well, folks, if you have a question for the doc, uh, a question, comment, suggestion, anything, testimony, uh, uh, yes. I, I, I think somebody over there, uh, I think that might be Prophet Elijah, opened up his mic. Do you have a question, topic, or suggestion, Prophet Elijah, there in Pike Road, Alabama? Yes, I do. And uh, first, of, first of all, I want to just 
say hi to you and Dr. Miles for the great work you're doing. But you was talking about the gland rejuvenator. Yes. And so I ask, I'm, I'm calling to ask about the pineal gland. What is the best thing to re rejuvenate the pineal gland? Are you back to the Q&A? Uh, are you with me, Doc? I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, he's asking about the pineal gland. And and uh, and if you if you have anything that you're using for the pineal gland, I'm using the gland rejuvenator because when the secret to, that I that I found is that working on all the glands at the same time. That's why that gland rejuvenator has about mm, about 28 or more than that. It, it, it has eight separate formulations, probably about 56 different herbs in that one uh, formulation. Uh, and uh, it, it's a it's a work of art because I'm working on all the glands at the same time. So rather than picking just the thyroid, the pituitary or the pineal or any other gland of the body, working on all of them at the same time with a gland rejuvenator. Now it helps all the glands go back to work because it is because they all work together. So that's how it works. But that's what I would use is the gland rejuvenator formula number 1196. Uh, are you with me? Yes. yes. Oh, yes. I'm here. Yes. Mm, okay. So, so that's how I work on that pineal. Uh, but uh, uh, again, uh, working on all the glands and, and working on the kidneys and working on the liver, that unlocks the whole deal. You see, a lot of times we're just, we, we, we're looking at just one thing. But if you're working on just one thing and you include several other systems that are associated and that will increase the uh, immune response, then you are doing something that goes beyond just working on one thing and targeting one thing. Uh, when, I, when I go after a particular problem, I'm working out of the box. I'm working on, I'm looking at everything else that may be offended, affected, uh, uh, participating uh, in, in that, and I'm including it all and giving so much support uh, that, bam, I'm, I'm over it right quick and moving on to the next thing. And, and the thing about it is, once you get something working, like the glands, then you don't have to continue to take the gland formula or the kidney formula or, or these other things because the body goes back to work. It's been nourished. It's been corrected. It doesn't need these things except to get it going again. So that's, that's, how, that's what I think about that, uh, uh, Prophet uh, Elijah. Well, I sure appreciate that very much because I noticed that it has a specific role for each gland, but there was some things someone was talking to me about today. They wanted to know how to, to enhance it and what I know it was talking about the, the fluoride can cause it to be what somewhat malfunction. Yeah, fluoride right. will, will, will cause the glands to malfunction. Absolutely. It, it, it's a poison. And it's, yes. it, it, it's, it's terrible that they've that, – that's what they used in Nazi – concentration camps to dumb down people so that they could lead them into uh, slaughter. That's what they yes. did. They used, they used that. that and, 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 uh, and some politician apparently, uh, politicians apparently, uh, were paid off to let it into our supply uh, by evil people. And that a lot of that goes on, and that's the problem in America, is that politicians take all this graft and greed money and, and, and uh, to do evil things. Uh, and, and, and it's rampant. And that's why Americans are, uh, are unhappy uh, with the politicians and the political system as a whole. Uh, and, and that's why they always worried about riots and 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 and. and uh, and so forth is because they know they've done so many. There, there's so many evil politicians have done so many evil things that uh, uh, that uh, uh, people are are finding out about it more and more and more because they're because now we have the internet. Uh, we we have uh, computers. 
Uh, we've got cell phones. Uh, we've got communication uh, more than ever before, and politicians are worried about that. They want to own the Internet. They want to control what you know and what you hear and what you see because they're afraid you're going to find out what they're doing. Anyway, that's my two cents on that. <laughs> well, so, I appreciate that. I appreciate that. <laughs> so, my friend, um, <clears throat> do we have any other questions? Or, or any other topic that we should look into.